Hey, what's up guys? This is Dude Tech and welcome back with another new video. In this video, I have another beautiful twist to share it with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. With that being said, let's get started. Okay, so I receive a lot of comments. They keep asking me about what kind of theme that you use. There is a lot of friends and a lot of fans on the channel. They keep asking me about is that a theme are you still using the shake it plus or just shake it a uh, theme on your iDevice now right now actually I'm using the animation plus theme and I'm gonna be showing you guys it's uh, actually an old and famous theme that you can set it on your iDevice just like so so you guys can see right now most of the thing that I have all the icons is kind of like uh, we have some movement on it it's alive and it's really beautiful to set it on your i device so let me just jump right now on city and showing you guys so this is the animation plus theme it's under the big boss you can find it easily and uh, once you download the, the theme is going to be providing you with a lot of uh, stuff once you set it under the fungal tweak all right so uh first thing for the guys that who don't know how to set that so used to be first of all to download fengal tweak on your i device and then after that you can just go ahead and download the animation plus theme and then you can find that on your fengal tweak just like so so once you just open fengal so easily you can just hold and drag the theme that you want just like so and uh, once you're done from that, just go ahead and respring your device. So your device will be take that effect. And as you guys can see right now, most of the beautiful icons that I have on my home screen, not just those, but most of the other icons, it has to be some shaking and uh, some life on every single icon that I have on my iDevice. So there you go, guys. As I told you, animation plus theme under the big boss. Next, what I have for you guys, CC data more. So when you download the tweak, that tweak is going to be providing you with cellular data on your control center, just like so. And, and then even the 3D touch is going to be work on it. So if I go right now and open my control center, as you guys can see right now, it's adding that toggle here. So you can turn that on and then you can turn that off. And then even you can use your 3D touch, force touch on it. And this is how is that tweak is gonna be providing you with. When you download the tweak, the tweak has nothing to configure. It will be work right away when you download the tweak using your iDevice. There you go guys, CC data more. And next what I have for you guys, no third apps on the settings. This is pretty nice tweak. So what that tweak is going to be providing you with is going to be move and hide most the third apps section from your settings. And I'm going to be showing you guys how is that going to be looks like. So usually when you go to your settings, you will be find all the third apps here in the bottom. So here is my settings this is from the top all the way to the bottom it's nothing so it's completely the section it's gone from the uh, all the third apps that i have on my i device this is what is that tweak is going to be providing you with once you download it and once you download the tweak it has nothing to configure it will be work right away when you download on your i device there you go guys highly recommend to download this one if you want to hide your third apps section from your settings no third apps in the settings and next what i have for you guys another beautiful home screen widget from evelyn now i'm going to be showing you guys how to set that on your i device and how it looks like on your lock screen under the settings first thing that you need to do to go to your lock html4 in order to make those working and then after that you need to go to select widget from here and then you pick the one that I, that you already download once you pick that lock your device let me show you guys how is that going to be looks like. This is the theme that I already told you guys about it. It's really nice, tiny, beautiful. It's in the top of the page on your lock screen. Really beautiful to set it on your lock screen. Let me just bring that closer so you guys take a look. It's really beautiful and nice if you want to set it on your lock screen. And next what I have for you guys, another lock screen widget from Evelyn. And this one is the LSEW112N. And I'm going to be showing you guys how to set that. 
okay guys so under the settings you need to hit lock html again and then you're going to be find the one that you download under the select widget from here and this is the 112 so i'm going to be press on it and i'm going to be optimize that and then save some changes here if you want to uh, add something hit save and then let me just go back right now to the lock screen showing you guys how that looks like and there you go guys this is the new one or this is the one that i already download and set on my lock screen how beautiful that is so if you're looking for that kind of stuff you can download right now link will be in the description for you guys there you go guys lsew 112n from evelyn i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please just like always give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos this is do tech catch you guys in the next video peace